Hey, Mike Sander from Sewing Products Equipment Company here, and today we're going to talk about ultrasonic cutting and welding. Uh, we have our most popular model in here right now. This is the TTS 400. As you can see, it also comes with a generator. Uh, for US use, we always make this a 110 volt, so you can just plug it into any old outlet. Um, this is the most standard version. This is great for cutting in straight lines, making curves, whatever. Uh, we also have this version of it as well. This is the pin grip style. This is a little bit better for uh, free handing. So you can come in and let's just say you don't want to actually go in on the material. You just want to cut out a square right here in the middle. You just go in and you cut that out right there. Um, and then we've also got a pistol grip style, which uh, again is used for cutting the same way that one is. The good thing about that one and this one really is you can put different uh, horns or heads, whatever you want to call them. I typically call them horns on this. And typically, uh, if you get one that's a little bit flatter, uh, like this one here, what it'll actually do is it'll just weld the material without cutting it. Uh, so this is really, really great for if you're doing um, any type of PPE, that little weld mark right there is, is ultrasonically done. So that's what this is used for. Uh, again, it's 110 volt. Uh, the great thing about this type of cutting is it's really not dangerous at all. And it's really, really good at after you cut the material, it seals it in the process. So as you can see, this material right here frays really, really easily. I mean, it's got fray everywhere. Uh, so if you cut this stuff, it's kind of a nightmare whenever you're actually going through and trying to, you know, sew the garment and make it look nice and neat. Um, so we'll go through and kind of show you exactly what I'm talking about here. So we'll just get the cut started and uh, we'll just go straight through it all the way. Okay, so that's it. And as you can see, there's no frame at all on either side. None at all, it's not fraying at all. This frays a ton. That is completely sealed. 